Hi, I'm Tim at Slide Dynamic, and this is a quick tutorial of how to embed an online Prezi and an offline Prezi uh, into an Articulate Storyline uh, application. So, sorry for the poor audio. Um, so, two things. Uh, first of all, I've uh, created a Prezi. Uh, you can do so on Prezi.com or with Prezi's desktop application. In both cases, you will need to create a portable Prezi, which uh, uh, renders out a zip file, which you then need to uh, uncompress. Um, so it will not work with PEZ files. It must be a portable Prezi. Um, so here it is. And if you unzip the file, you'll see three items, a data folder, a Prezi.app if you're on a PC, or it's just the Prezi executable if you're on a Mac, and Prezi.exe. Um, there's two additional files you'll need if you're watching this on a YouTube. Uh, you can find the link in the description to download these or if you're in our forum you'll find the link at the bottom of the thread. You don't need the Prezi.exe um, so we can kind of just delete that. You can leave it there if you wish but if you're sending this or posting it online um, you, uh, you're probably best to delete that and you do not need the Prezi.app file so we can delete that also. So all you need is the data folder index.html and the prezi.swf. Okay, so that's uh, my offline prezi and here is my online prezi. Obviously you would have your own. Um, so let's go ahead and just quickly create this uh, articulate storyline. So I'll keep it simple. I won't add any content or any course content or anything like that. Uh, what I'll do is I'll simply quickly create a new project. Okay, and what we'll do is just create two scenes. I'll click the first scene. Um, in the first scene or wherever you wish to display your Prezi, I'll do an online version first. Just click Insert, go to Insert Web Object, and it gives you uh, a web address. So in order just to display the Prezi and not the entire Prezi's web page, uh, you need to add some code here. So again, I'll leave this uh, in the tutorial as well, so you can just copy and paste. So this gives you direct access to the Prezi. Uh, so first of all, that's the generic code you need to um, po uh, sort of, if you like, paste. Let's just get rid of that. So it's HTTP. Right, um, next we want to go back to where our Prezi is that we wish to embed. And in the URL of the Prezi, you'll see a unique string of data that comes directly after prezi.com forward slash. So we just need to copy that and then go back. And after the equal sign, just paste it. And that's that. So that's the um, that's the, the, the sort of online version. So you'll need to be connected to the internet to see it. Uh, next, we'll do an offline. So double click on that. Same process, insert, web object. But in this case, uh, you just need to hit the, the folder icon. Uh, we just need to go to wherever the downloaded Prezi is on your PC. So I've stuck this somewhere. Um, where have I put it? So I've put it in my Articulate Projects, and this is my Prezi. And I just need to, once I've clicked the folder, I just click OK, and it automatically inserts the Prezi with the index.html. So that's the offline version. Um, so let's go ahead and publish that now. So let's just give it my brooding money. Uh, click publish. Important thing to mention, when it's kind of creating uh, the, the finished storyline application, all the uh, downloaded Prezi content is copied into the relevant folder. Uh, I'll show you what I mean. So let's get rid of that. Uh, if we just go back, so you'll see this is my downloaded Prezi. Let's delete that actually. Okay, so this is my, my sort of finished storyline. Um, so if I double click it, and just to explain where it's been put, so if you go into storyline content, web objects and you'll find a unique reference here and inside that you'll see those three files so that's the uh, the embedded uh, downloaded Prezi so wherever you send this file or post it online you'll see that uh, the relevant uh, you know link is is maintained 
So let's go and go ahead and see it. So I'm just going to click the HTML. This won't render out an HTML5, by the way, so don't try it. We can try it, but it won't work. Okay. So this is my online Prezi, uh, which is embedded. Uh, in this version, you need to click this button as you would any embedded Prezi to make it play. Uh, obviously, we have applications that can bypass that, but uh, you can see this is my online Prezi, and I can go ahead and, and just go and do all the things that you um, you do with Prezi. Um, okay, so that's my online Prezi, and this is my offline Prezi. You'll see you don't have to click the button. Uh, this loads automatically, and then you can go through and do what you do with your online Prezi. And up to my son. So there you are, that's uh, uh, an online and, and offline. So I hope it's useful. Um, you'll find the links to download all this stuff, uh, as, as I say, in the description of this YouTube video or at the bottom of this thread in our forum. Thanks very much.